Hi, uh, welcome to my channel, uh, Astro Journey UK. Um, so uh, this evening or this afternoon, I noticed that the uh, the forecast had dramatically improved, and um, it's going to be clear skies tonight. So um, uh, I thought I'd get the uh, get the equipment out and um, do some imaging. But I decided to uh, do a bit of recording and uh, take you along with the journey. Good evening. So, um, yep, tonight's uh, clear skies, and I'm going to be uh, imaging the Leo triplet. Um, so, I've got my uh, Skywatcher Evo Star 80 ED Pro out, and also my ZWO ASI 533 MC one shot color camera. Uh, so, yep, it's looking like it's going to be a good night. So, uh, see you later. So I'm doing multi-star guiding at the moment as well. Um, maybe it manages to get away with it with the uh, trees, but I'm not too sure. Um, so the guiding is not too bad at the moment, given the fact I'm going through trees. Um, I'm hoping that that's going to properly settle down in a minute, um, and I can get get imaging. Uh, so using uh, Astro Photography tool. Uh, currently the camera should be uh, should be cooling at the moment, although it's still um, 6.6 .6 degrees. Turns out the uh, camera cools a lot quicker if you actually plug it in. Never mind. Anyway, it's getting down there to uh, minus 20. Let's kick off some uh, some live view. Do it just five seconds for now, and also stretch it and see, uh, see if we can see anything. Don't think it's the easiest target to see, but it should be finding Leo triplet somewhere. My plan is to um, you know, shoot, shoot some 300 second um, subs. Um, yeah, let's, let's get that going and see uh, see what we can see, and uh, I'll come back in a minute. Um, so it's a bit difficult to see that. I've actually now um, lined up the Leo triplet. I've had to do it manually because I've only got the coordinates for the, the galaxies themselves rather than the bit in the middle. Um, so I've lined that up, but what I'm going to do now is go into point craft. <coughs> um, just blind solve this Image part solved. of the night sky. Um, so I've got the coordinates there. I can now store that um, and just type Leo uh, triplet. The object name and also for the, the actual name itself. Um, get the uh, scope RAM declination uh, just by clicking on that, and then I can save that. And then next time I want to plate solve and go back to this exact location, uh, I just need to select this from the uh, the custom list at the top. Um, so that's how I kind of managed to do this uh, night after night. So that's that. So, uh, I'm now imaging. Uh, the plan is, oh, so I'm on um, minus 20 degrees C for the uh, camera itself. Imaging plan set up there. Um, so going with, for now, count of uh, 10 times 5 minute exposures. Uh, go over to um, guiding and grab 
photographs kind of looking okay. Um, declination's not too bad. Uh, the RA though looks a bit iffy, hopefully it's going to settle itself down. Uh, basically I think I've got some problems with the, um, the right ascension at the moment. The clutch doesn't properly disengage so um, yeah, hopefully I won't have any problems but we'll, uh, we'll see. Uh, so I'm going to leave that now and um, come back to that later. So we're uh, coming up on the first exposure. Fingers crossed. Exposure finished. Exposure started. Uh, let's just have a quick look at the stars. They're uh, looking pretty good. Quite happy with that. Um, and then stretch it. And there you go. You can see the... Um, Three galaxies of the Leo triplet. So uh, hopefully it's going to look quite nice. I've managed to quite get it square in the frame there. If you kind of look at that, um, two galaxies. I think they're was it M66, maybe 65. Um, on the left, not quite. Um, could be a little bit further over to the right, but I want to keep with that for now. So um, it's about midnight and uh, yeah, things definitely haven't gone according to plan. Um, a summary of the evening so far is, um, yep, everything went really, really well. Uh, plate solved, got the target eventually, uh, stored that target for next time. Um, got some, uh, some images down. Uh, those, those images, it looked like it was, uh, I was getting 300 second images, which is uh, five minutes and pretty good. Uh, there was a lot of detail coming through. Hopefully I might get some kind of image to share with you at the end, but I might not. Um, so we'll have to see how that goes. Um, but uh, either way, uh, thank you for watching. If you've watched all the way through this video, then uh, well done for, for you. Um, if you want to be kind, hit that like button. Um, if you've kind of learned something or appreciate something, hit that like button. Um, but also if you also want to uh, hit the subscribe button uh, to see more videos of me failing at astrophotography because um, it's a difficult hobby and uh, not everyone gets it right and actually to be fair most people don't get it right. Um, but yeah hit that subscribe button hit the bell and uh, next time I post a video of me failing at astrophotography you can watch that one as well. So uh, that's it for today and uh, thank you for watching and see you soon.